Hi everyone, hope you're all keeping well. In today's video I'm going to be showing you some more of my Yomiko Classics collection. These ones I'm showing you today are my Yomiko Dreamers. I love these guys, they are super colourful. I mentioned them uh, a couple of videos ago when I was talking about some colourful plush that aren't overly realistic looking. In terms of the actual breed of dog, um, they've got the features down pat on these ones, but obviously in terms of the colour, as you can see, they are not realistic colours. In saying that, I love these guys so much, how colourful they are. Um, you might have noticed that my handle is Colour Me Ames. I'm a big fan of lots of colours and you always see the different colours in the quilts and things that I use to show you guys my videos. So. I love how colourful these ones are and I hope you love them too. There is a bit of a mix um, in what it says on the tag. Some say Yomiko Classics, some say Yomiko Dreamers. I think that's when Russ was changing over into being called Suki. Uh, but I believe they're all from the same range. They all do look very similar in terms of how they've done the colouring. I've got the pinks and purples mainly down the bottom and then up the top, um, you know, your blues purple, yellow and green. But anyway, I'll show you one by one uh, so you can see a little bit closer and uh, if you ever have the chance to pick up one of these, they're super cute and I highly recommend having one. They definitely brighten up the room and make you feel happy when you look at them. So here we go. So this is the first one. They do still have some sort of airbrushing. I'm not sure if you guys can see uh, the different colouring. It's sort of got a little bit of purple on the ears there. This one's called the Blue Labrador, I believe, if we just have a look. So Suki, Blue Labrador. On this one it still says Yomiko Classics. Um, but yeah, Suki Gift International on that one. So there you are. I just love it. It's just so much colour happening. So he's got pink paw pads and he's got the purple nose and the purple in the blue. It's just really lovely. So there's your blue Labrador. The next one I believe is the Jack Russell. Just look how cute. And as I'm showing you guys these, they're all probably close to, I don't know, 30 centimeters, just under 30 centimeters in length. It's a nice size. So yeah, this is the green Jack Russell. Obviously he's got more than green going on, but the main color that they've had there is the green. They're really unique. I never saw these in the store. I only saw them online and I just fell in love with them. So if anyone sees them in store, let me know. I'd love to know if they've got any new ones. I haven't seen any, but they may do. So the next one is a pug. No mistaking that. I would say they probably have called it a pink pug. Yep, pink pug with lots of purple. So mainly pink and purple for this one. Again, super duper lovely. As you can see, I love the tail too. <laughs> Alright, so this one's a little bit different. So this one might be an older version. It's still got that leatherette tag. This is what I was talking about, Yomiko Dreamers, instead of it saying Yomiko Classics like some of my other ones that I've shown you guys. So this one is your purple Rottweiler or Rottweiler, depending on how you want to say it. And again, this one has that different tush tag as well. So it still says Russ, as opposed to the other ones that I've just shown you, they say Suki. But all the same family. Isn't he lovely? Or she? I, haven't, I don't think any of these have names. Could probably just leave it as Purple Rottweiler and give them, well, you know, give them some nicknames. I think I do like to name my plush, but just look at the purple eyes. It's really nice that they've got lots of different colours because, you know, depending on what your favourite colour is, you could probably get one. I know they're missing some colours, but, you know, as a broad range, you may ha lean towards one of these colours. I think for myself, I do love purple um, as a colour, then next closely a blue. So I've got heaps of purple going on here and obviously some blue too. But as I said, I love all colours, so I love them all to bits. So this is a Fox Terrier. This one also has that Yomiko Dreamers leatherette tag on it. As you can see, super duper colourful. Just show you the tag. Pink and purple Fox Terrier. 
for a little bit of someone else's fur there. There we go. So please let me know guys in the comments below like which one's your favourite, what's your favourite colour, what sort of unique plush have you got that we can have a look at. I love to see new plush as I'm going through uh, YouTube or Instagram, whatever I'm looking at. So I believe this one is a green Labrador. Yumiko Dreamers. Yeah, green Labrador. So in comparison, I'll just pop him back there so we can have a look at him next as a blue. So you've got your two Labradors, super sweet. Um, this one's got that Yomiko Dreamers tag, this one does not. Um, they've got the different tags as well. These ones are a little bit more pink, pinky purple. Different, but sort of the same, <laughs> if that makes sense. And next up we'll show you the pink Dash Hound. Very lovely, sort of just got that super soft face about it. I love that. And let's go. So pink dash hound with a little blue detailing, which is really nice. I've got them all out of the order that I started with, guys. That is the story of my life when I'm looking at my toys. But I will make sure that we don't get muddled up. So these ones left to show you. So here we are, look at that face. I believe this would be a purple Dalmatian. Yeah, purple Dalmatian. I really like that they've kept the main uh, white of your, the white color of your usual Dalmatian, but they've done just the purple spots. It's <laughs> super adorable. It's like simple, but really cute. I love it how they've done that one. So there's your purple Dalmatian. And next up, I believe this one is the Beagle. They trick me a little bit. I have to sometimes check to make sure I'm getting it right, obviously, because they are the different colours. But yes, the Blue Beagle with the purple. Again, it doesn't have that leatherette collar. And it says Yomiko Classics, but I like the Yomiko Dreamers aspect that the original sort of earlier ones have, which is really awesome. I believe this one is a German Shepherd. I think they've just gone with Shepherd though on the back of the tag. Yeah, yellow Shepherd. So you can assume it to be whichever kind of Shepherd you want. I've gone with German Shepherd, but lovely purple and yellow. So there you go, anybody, if your two favorite colors are purple and yellow, this one might be for you, the yellow Shepherd. And two more to go. This is a Chihuahua. Can't mistake those ears. We'll just see how they've gone. Pink Chihuahua. Super lovely. I don't show you guys the bottom of the plush very often, but for anyone interested, that's what its belly looks like. Super cute, super lovely. Lovely and colourful. Oops, sorry guys. And last but not least, the King Charles Spaniel. It's got that detailing on the ears and it even sort of feels nice and textured how they've got those lines going through which is really sweet get a really sweet face I say that about all of them I just fall in love with them when I get them it's very rare that a plush arrives and I don't really connect with it I, I guess I sort of study the photo of what it looks like online first ideally if they've got the actual in hand plush which most of these were so I was able to see you know, what their faces look like before I got it. A bit unfortunate sometimes when you just have to go by the stock photo, but we make do when that happens. So as I said, the purple King Charles Spaniel. Sorry if it's gone a little bit shaky there. My wrist is hurting me today. It's a little bit hard to hold the camera and show you, but I was determined to do a video because I've been behind. Um, Bubs and myself have been a little bit unwell, so we're a bit behind in doing a lot of things. You might hear it in my voice. I'm not sure if I still got a little bit of a croaky voice, but I persevered. I wanted to show you guys another video. So there you are, guys. There's all the Yomiko classics or Yomiko Dreamers, depending on which one you pick up. I like to go by Yomiko Dreamers, though, as I said. So please let me know if you've got any suggestions for names for these ones. At the moment, they are just called 
whatever it says on the tush tag. <laughs> um, but I should get some cute names to go with them and I'll update that uh, in the description over time and definitely I'll pop it on my Instagram when I pop them up as well. Again, my Instagram's the same handle as my YouTube handle, so Colour Me Ames. So yeah, if you're interested, come have a look. And uh, I love following other plushy accounts as well, so if you've got plush to show, let's have a look. Share the love. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed looking at these guys. And until next time, keep each other safe. Okay, bye.